How's it going? Yeah, it's good. Uh, uh, yeah, it's really good. We, we started to building up something here and it feels like we're on the right path. And uh, yeah, growing as a team and, and, and it feels like it's getting better and better for me too. So yeah, it's nice. How do you feel like it's getting better for you? Like, what, what have you felt about your game in the last couple of weeks? Uh, I, th I feel like the last couple of weeks I've been uh, at least the, the two the two last games been more involved in the game, like having the puck more, taking better decisions with the puck when when you're gonna uh, do the simple things or when you're gonna when you're gonna search for, for search for a pass or, or or stuff like that, and and also like creating a little bit more, coming to, to a little bit more shots and. And stuff like that, and also having, uh, getting my feet moving a little bit more, and and joining the rush a little bit more. So, yeah, I feel like it's it's going the right path. Does there come a point, or has there come a point where you felt more comfortable? I'm sure the first couple of games, first games in the NHL, there's a lot going on. But have you? Is it been progressively a little bit better each game, or, or was there a turning point for you? Do you feel like it feel, feels like it's it has been better and better throughout the games, but for sure it's going up and down and having some better games and then you have 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 worse games so I feel like maybe after like eight ten games you felt like okay and this is how I need to play and, and how I need to like like go from uh, like uh, my game is gonna develop this way and I'm like yeah trying to go from that and like getting more comfortable and uh, I think the biggest thing has been more co being more comfortable comfortable and confident with the puck and, and making better plays I think that has been and uh, the better part of, at least the, the last games what about the mental approach of dealing with the ups and downs? How, how do you handle that? Yeah, for sure, it's a new thing. It's a new thing being here. You, you, you're used to to being back home, you, knowing your role and like having your role and and know that you you're gonna play your minutes. And now you're coming here and and, and starting from the beginning again and, and starting to 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 like coming into a new team and like getting to know everybody and getting to know your role and and uh, and starting to hopefully climbing up and playing more minutes and, and stuff like that but it's it's also a start and you need to to, to, tr to trust the process and not stress and uh, I feel like I have good support from coaches good support from the teammates and uh, yeah I got everything I need to, to develop and being a good NHL player it feels like when coach occasionally makes a decision to not play you in a game is there anything that you can benefit from that whether it's watching the game from a different perspective, or is there anything about that that helps you at all? Yeah, I think like for sure you want to play every game. That's how you learn the best. But uh, also like just being around, like taking uh, a night off. Uh, it's like it's not bad, but for sure I want to play. But it's it's not a bad thing, and I like recognize everything and seeing seeing a game from there. Uh, it's not bad, but for sure you want to play. Did Did you come away from the most recent one? Did you come away from that? Thinking, okay, this is something that I noticed that I want to try to do better. Or, or yeah, but change. it's it feels like like when you watch the games, you you always learn, and when you watch watching players play, like, and also like, uh, yeah, for sure, you're, you're trying to watch watch a lot of like Foxy playing. For sure, he's an unreal player, but uh, you can learn a lot from him how Paul is, and and like his decision with the puck is unreal, and uh, yeah, like you can learn from everybody, and. Uh, and when you like, I, I like seeing the games and like, 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 uh, develop from that. So yeah, it's it has been like for sure good, but like you're learning more from playing. Has Fox given you any specific advice that was helpful? Not that like really, but he said like the guys aren't like in the beginning of the season. He said like the guys aren't that smart that you think. So let's <laughs> <laughs> yeah. go out there and have fun. Yeah. You, you said uh, when you were in the SHL, you knew you were going to be on the power play. You knew you were going to have a certain role. Is it, is it take a certain work ethic or does it take a certain attitude to sort of start back at the bottom and have to work your way up again? Yeah, like for sure it's, it's like, but it's the same thing when I was back home. Like you start, you're starting not from the bottom, but you're starting as like a, a 760 and then you're climbing up during the years. And uh, I was in Lulio for, for four years and, 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 and ended up having a, a good role there. So it's no like stress and you now you now we're starting from the beginning again like being the the six seven D and and yeah trying to to develop and being better and better and hopefully making progress and getting more trust from the coaches and getting your playing time so uh, yeah it's no stress but uh, yeah it also feels like you have everything uh, and you're gonna learn from every day and for sure you want to play better too. Do you feel like that experience made you I guess more patient? Before this experience? Yeah, for sure. Like being back home and 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 for for those many years and and also like getting getting through. Like I had a good first year co coming back. Had, had a 
had a tougher second year and, and, and like, how do you say, like starting from the bottom again and climbing up again and uh, yeah, for sure making that progress and has, has, I think that has been huge for me and for my development. Uh, yeah, coming here had a little bit more like experience and, and, and stuff like that. So yeah, I think that was good for me. You mentioned uh, the, getting the trust of the coaching staff. Do you feel like the fact that they've played you a lot so far has shown that you, that you have some trust? Do you, do you feel comfortable with that aspect of it? Yeah, for sure. But also, like we are, we are eight, eight really good D's that want to play here too. So it's a comp competition every day, and it's eight really great guys. And and you want to play your best game uh, every night, and uh, you don't feel safe out there too. And I think that's a good thing. Like you need to improve. You you can't like stay calm and. And, and just like, yeah, I'm going to play every game and relax. And like, you need to play your best game every night and develop and, and getting more playing time like that. That's, that's the biggest thing. If you're playing better, you, you're usually getting more playing time too.